sorry. Habit. Still holding it. All right. You're good. Word of warning, I will get the exclusive. I always do. Why wasn't your van at the fire? It was. I just came separately. I share the van with other reporters sometimes. Can you tell me a little bit about your van? I never pictured myself as the kind of person to drive around in a van. But I have to admit, this one is pretty cool. Why is that? First thing, it's less of a van and more of a mobile action center. I spend more time in here prepping stories than I do at home. Why are you playing me up as the villain in the media? I'm just doing my job. I'm letting the world know about all of the suspicious things you've done. You should be reporting on the truth, not trying to grab a better job. My life is at stake. Mine too. And anyway, what good does telling the truth do if no one can hear you? Is there a way I could get in touch with you later? Good question. Why don't you take one of my cards? Is this your cell phone number? Yes. Do you mind if I look around in the van? Yes. For a variety of reasons, Nancy. First, it's mine, so no. Second, I have dirt on everyone in this town in here. And as a journalist, it's my ethical duty to make sure that all of the embarrassing footage I've got stays private until such a time that it is fit for broadcast. You mean, like, blackmail? No. No! Is that what you think of me? Yes. It's not blackmail. It's fact-checking. I have to balance the individual's right to privacy with the public's need to know. You didn't exactly extend that courtesy to me. Didn't I? I think the public needs to know everything it can about the criminal. I'm sorry. Alleged criminal activity. Why, why don't you try doing it to yourself? You then you'll see how everyone, the everyone how sees you, you. When news breaks, I get there first. Yes, I've seen the ad. I mean, how do you make it to the scene first? It's a secret of the trade. You were Someone's in a cranky mood. So fast. How did you manage that? It's my job to be ready at a second's notice. Some people think I'm just lucky. I prefer to think I'm just that good. Bye. 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 This was already on Nancy's phone, though. It's funny, though. You have reached the Heights 9 Action News Tip line for Brenda Carlton. Please speak clearly when prompted. To report breaking news in the North River Heights area, say yes. Otherwise, say no. Yes. Yes! You have indicated a breaking news story in the North River Heights area. Brenda Carlton will be notified directly. Goodbye. Okay, now we what now we get to search her van. Wait. Alcohol. It looks like this is for cleaning the equipment, but if she has more, how could Brenda have possibly made it to all of those interviews so quickly? It doesn't make sense. This opens this. Your best Marvin, Nancy's closest friend and confidant. Yes. Did she tell you about her plans to burn down Town Hall? No, she didn't. I mean, she didn't burn anything. It must have come as a shock to discover what your friend had done. But she didn't. It's natural to be in denial. You just want the best for your friend, yes? Of course. Who else would she have told her plans to? No one. Has she always been secretive like that? No. So just recently? That's not what I meant. Does she have any enemies? Well, she solves crimes, so there might be some hard feelings from the people she's gotten in trouble. She solves crimes, so she must be pretty familiar with how criminals cover up their tracks. Yeah, she knows all of the tricks. Wait, what are you getting at? <laughs> if anyone could get away with the perfect crime, it'd be Nancy, right? I don't know about that. So you think there's potential she won't get away with burning down Town Hall? That's not what I said at all. So you do think she'll get away with it? She didn't do it. She's not guilty. I can see that this is very emotional for you. Thank you for your time. We'll continue to follow the story as it develops. You didn't... 
You took what I said and screwed it all up. Oh no, Bess. You did great. I know it's upsetting, but really well done. I want to go again. Great. I'll find you as details develop. Oh, Bess. Wait. What's Deirdre doing back there? I should try modifying the settings of the other tracks to enhance the background track and hear what she was saying. That's it. Only four more tracks to go. Well, this is total gas. Your best mark. Mm-hmm. 